In this first video, this house's ring doorbell captured a man walk up to the front door in the middle of the night. But rather than actually knocking on the door or ringing the doorbell, the man pretends to do so. At first it seems odd, until you realize what's actually going on. Near the left side of the screen, a car's headlights can be seen. It's clear whoever is driving the vehicle is making this guy walk up and talk to the house owner for a seemingly sinister purpose as the guy obviously doesn't want to do it. I mean, so much so that he fakes knocking on the door and even fakes a conversation with the house owner, all the while making sure the driver can see him doing so. From the fake conversation, it's clear the driver wants the man to look for someone named Matt. One comment guessed the man could have been being forced to rob the place, but didn't want to do it, making him fake the whole situation and claim no Matt lived there. But to this day, the real motives of the driver are still unclear. This footage features a random woman walking up to someone's front door. The woman clearly isn't acting normal or at least until a car passes where she breaks character so as not to draw attention to herself. After the car is gone, the woman can be seen putting her face right up to the camera. After watching the disturbing footage, the house owner would claim he had no idea who the woman was. This doorbell camera video shows the horrifying early stages of a fire in a neighbor's property. As the video goes on, you can see as the fire gradually continues to grow, so much so that it eventually reaches the house with the doorbell camera. At the time of the fire, the house owner himself was asleep, though he would be woken up by multiple notifications on his phone claiming motion was detected by his doorbell camera. After reviewing the footage, the house owner would frantically run to get a fire extinguisher and desperately attempt to put the fire out. But after realizing it was too late, the house owner would escape through the house's back door. It's pretty safe to say that the motion detected notifications that woke up the house owner saved his life that night. This video captured a woman frantically knocking on this house's front door. As she continues to do so, she can be seen constantly looking behind her. And that's when you realize why. A man walks up to the woman and proceeds to grab her firmly, telling her to get into the car. All the while, the woman can be heard pleading for him to stop. The man in the video was later identified to be 20-year-old Victor Kucic, and he would ultimately be charged with third-degree felony kidnapping. This ring doorbell starts off showing the house owner simply doing her laundry, though before she can even enter the laundry room, she can be seen pausing, and the audio from the clip makes it clear as to why.
A voice can be heard desperately pleading for help, though it's unclear as to where the voice is coming from. Clearly disturbed, and worried it could have been someone hiding around her property, the woman would end up calling the police. I looked around, I didn't see anybody out on the road or any cars or anything. So I went back to my ring video to make sure I wasn't just courageously hearing something. I can hear somebody saying something, but I can't. Well, I posted it on there. The police would search the whole property, but find absolutely nothing. And to this day, it's still unclear whose voice was talking, or even where it was coming from. This doorbell camera footage seems to have captured an almost transparent looking figure walking across the house owner's property in the middle of the night. The figure looks to have no face, and seems to slowly become less visible as it continues to move. The audio from the video reveals the noise of very faint footsteps. After reviewing the footage, and examining around the property, the house owner found nothing out of the ordinary and it's still unclear what exactly was caught on video that night. The owner of this house would wake up to a notification on his phone telling him motion was detected at his front door. And after reviewing the footage, this is what he found. There was an old woman with a knife just standing at his front door constantly shifting her body weight from side to side. The woman can be seen awkwardly holding and looking at the knife, as well as constantly glancing all around her. After a few more seconds, the woman finally attempts to ring the doorbell, but seemingly can't bring herself to do it for whatever reason. and after two minutes of footage, it cuts off. It's still unclear who this woman was, or what caused her to walk up to a stranger's front door wielding a knife. After hearing his doorbell go off, this San Diego house owner would look at his doorbell camera through his phone, and the camera revealed a supposed door-to-door -door salesman waiting outside. The house owner decided to confront the man with the doorbell speaker, and that's when the salesman claimed he was looking for the Robinsons residence at 712, which was not the house he was at. After being informed of this, the salesman would politely apologize for the mix-up. Is this um, the Robinsons residence at 712? Uh, no, you're at the wrong house. It's 721. Oh, I apologize for that. Suspicious of the encounter, the house owner would send the footage to the local police department who, disturbingly, confirmed that this exact man was suspected of breaking into at least 19 homes and impersonating a salesman to do so. The man has yet to be caught by police. Likely taking place during the whole killer clown craze of 2016, this ring doorbell caught the exact moment someone dressed in a clown costume walked up to its front door. The person can be seen tilting their head and slowly walking up to the door, almost the whole time staring directly into the camera. While it's most likely just someone trying to scare people, there's a small chance something a lot more sinister is going on here. To this day, it's still unclear whether the house owner experienced anything further regarding the situation.